I'll start with with one of mine um, that I watched. Um, the movie I, I actually just saw it yesterday was Bull. Um, Bull is available on Hulu. Um, it is um, streamable on Hulu. Um, it is um, so not a lot of big names in this movie at all. Um, the biggest name I, and I've seen him before, but I, I don't know if I could tell you where is Rob Morgan. Um, Rob Morgan. Um, let me see. What have I seen him? In? Oh, that's yeah. That makes sense. He was in Daredevil. Um, if you saw Daredevil, he was Turk Barrett in Daredevil. So he was like a low level bad guy. He's a um, he's one of the the local the local deputies on Stranger Things too. It goes oh, around okay. with the other kind of goofy yeah. deputy guy. Yeah. 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 Um. So this movie is is about a little girl um, who's played by Amber Harvard. Um, who this that's literally her first role. This movie is her first role ever, uh, Amber Harvard. Um, and she is they're in Louisiana. Um, she is in a very, um, unfortunately, a very poor household. Her mother's in jail um, for drugs, uh, drug usage, selling something drug related. Um, it's her and her little sister, and they're living with her grandmother. Um, and she's she's a rough around the edge little girl. Um, she's very introverted. Um, but she she gets in fights and and, you know, uh, uh, knocks authority and, you know, but she's very introverted um, at one point as she's going through um, and her neighbor is Abe. Um, Abe is um, a and that's Rob Morgan. He is a rodeo clown. Um, he works for the PBR, um, but ends up getting hurt and PBR fires him um, because he just he's gotten hurt too many times. So they let him go. Um, and so he has to do what's that professional bull racing, not the, uh, Pabst blue ribbon professional bull riding. Yes. Um, and, riding. um, and so he, well, it's different. It's not racing. Bulls, they race riding. bulls where you come from. <laughs> um, and so, um, he has to lo work local events, but what he also does in his, in his spare time is he teaches other young, young boys, young men, um, to ride bulls as well, um, in Louisiana. Um, and so um, she actually ends up breaking into his house with a group of friends and they trash his place. They drink, they get wasted on his alcohol um, and they just, they just trash the place. Um, uh, he finds her. She actually falls asleep on the porch outside in the couch. Um, and he, he finds her calls the police. Um, she gets arrested. Um, the grandmother comes over before that officer takes her away and, and tries to, you know, begs the guy to, to let her go, you know, let her do something to, to, to make up for it, whatever. Um, and so he agrees and he basically has her work off the damage that she's done. I mean, he takes her with her as he goes to um, uh, a ranch where the bulls are. And as he teaches the bull riding and she carries around, you know, she does the manual labor for him um, at these things. Cause he's actually hurt pretty bad. He got hit by a bull right in the side. Um, and he's, he's pretty banged up. Um, and the the, sh the show progresses from there. And it quite frankly, from from the description I gave you, it's probably pretty self-explanatory as to what how the movie kind of they progresses. form a relationship. She, you know, right. Sort of so it's um, more generic. I will say um, just based off of that, I was 100 percent lost at the ending confused as all get out it <laughs> did not end the way i thought it was going to end i did not understand the ending the last 15 20 minutes confused the crap out of me just to putting that out there um so this movie actually has a 91 percent on rotten tomato um uh, it's directed by annie silverstein who i'm not sure if i've seen her anything else she's ever directed no everything else is shorts um, she's directed shorts. Okay. Um, this is the first full length that she's done. Um, I, I didn't get this movie. I, I, it wasn't, it wasn't a great movie for me. Um, it kind of, I get what they were going for. Um, but it just, there was nothing special about it. It was, it was a stereotypical take on this whole kid does something wrong has to make up for it creates relationship right like that's it's a fairly common theme and um i i really didn't i didn't like it um really hardly 
at all. There were there were scenes that didn't make any sense. Um, there's a scene where um, there's a I mean, a, he has a relationship with a woman and they she's in it for for five minutes. They show the scene with them having their relation and then she's not in it anymore. Like and it did. It didn't add anything to the story to me. Nothing at all. Um, and so I just it was it was a little confusing. Um, I, I wasn't I wasn't a fan. I just wasn't a fan of this movie. Um, the little girl um, is very one one dimension throughout the entire movie. Um, she doesn't really change in anything. Um, she's kind of like, you know, she's her her shoulders are slumped constantly. She's like she she says three word answers throughout the entire movie. I, I don't think she has any sentences longer than seven, eight words, two sentences long. Um, throughout the entire movie um, it was very very slow um, not that I expected it necessarily to be action packed but I thought it's about bull riding that there would be more aspects of the bull riding in it um, and it wasn't um, it just uh, not a great movie I was depressed and and maybe that's what they're going for is a depressed feel um, but I just it didn't do anything for me uh, unfortunately it was not uh, it was not one that I would I would recommend um, to watch at this point in time. It just wasn't great. It just wasn't great. Um, so, I, I mean, again, like uh, a movie last week, I can't remember which one the, she dies tomorrow. I think that Jason saw Yeah. these yeah. situations where we had these movies that are acclaimed and I don't manage to watch it. And then one of us reviews it and it's like the opposite of what, you know, critics, critics. are saying or whatever. Yeah. Makes me more interested to watch it, so I might. Like I honestly don't know if you. I, I where where she dies tomorrow. I could see where that would fall into your wheelhouse. I honestly don't think that even this one will fall into your wheelhouse. Hmm. I could be wrong. Um, you may like it, but I just I I don't even think you will appreciate it the way that it's supposed to be appreciated. Um, I could be wrong though. I could be wrong. Um, it just the it. It didn't make sense, particularly the ending. I think the ending is really what killed it for me. Had they done something differently to the ending, I might have enjoyed it slightly more than what I did. But um, I just I, I didn't feel this one at all. It, it just didn't do anything for me. I was I was disappointed in it. I really wanted to like this one again. Bull riding. I like bull riding. I think bull riding's cool. Um, I think that concept, that story, even though it's kind of a played out story of kid does something wrong, has to make up for it, relationship created, even even with that, I kind of was excited to kind of see how that story played out. And it just, it didn't do it. It didn't do it. I didn't get it. I didn't get it. Um, but but yeah, you may end up liking it and watching it like it, Brian, but I did not. I did not. And Aubrey didn't either. Not that that really... Um, it's not like you two have very similar tastes or anything, but, but, um, she wasn't, she didn't, wasn't a fan of it either. Just a, just a weird movie, man. A little disappointed. So there you have it. Bull. Um, I didn't enjoy it, but, but maybe you will. 